What's up? Welcome back to my channel. I am super excited to be here with you guys today because today is the first day that I am filming my first beauty YouTube video. Actually, I lied. I did one back in February, uh, but I'm doing a lipstick review with you guys today. So based on, so you guys might notice that I'm in a little bit of a different room today is because just the time of the day, this is the only room that gets like good lighting. So we're gonna film in here today. Yeah. Okay, so I love buying my makeup products at the drugstore because, I don't know why, because, because I just always been used to buying my makeup products at the drugstore. So today I decided to test five different lipsticks from five different brands of their new products that have just come out in the drugstore and I'm gonna test them out on me with you today to show you if you wanna go out and buy your own new Okay, so I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna try on the lipsticks and I'm gonna give you guys a review to see if I liked it and I'm gonna show you how it looks on me. And you know what? If you wanna go and buy it, go and buy it. And I'll give you my honest opinion. And yeah, it just makes lipstick picking out even better. So I literally am plain Jane today. I think I have a, like a little bit of mascara on, a little bit of BB cream, but absolutely nothing on my lips. So let's get into it. Okay. So the first lipstick we're going to try on is this red. It is the CoverGirl Katy Perry line in the color Crimson Cat. Now it's kind of like a red. I love when lipsticks are like fresh and haven't even been touched yet. It just feels so good. Wow. Okay. What do we think of this? I don't know guys. I think I actually really like it. It comes on as a really nice matte finish it is not messy at all and it's just a nice pop of cherry red it's so tasteful i actually really like it and i think this literally went on for i think it was on sale for like eight bucks when's it go i think i might have to go get other ones from this line i really like it it's such a clean finish lipstick not messy it's not chunky it's so i love it good job katie perry Okay, so I really like this one. So out of 10, I think I would give this one an eight and a half out of 10. I really, really did like it. Highly recommend this for all you guys out there who need like a nice, clean lipstick, that, like a matte lipstick that's not too expensive. I know these days a lot of people are kind of veering away from matte lipsticks because they don't like it, but I love them and I think they look so clean. So I highly recommend this one. Ah, getting all dirty. Okay, so make sure that you don't touch your white lips white lipstick cover and it'll get dirty <laughs> okay so focus focus okay so on to lipstick brand uh, number two okay so it's number 10 it's called dreamer the super stay matte ink matte ink lipstick Okay, this one doesn't have a lot of pigment to it, which I don't mind, which is why I got the color. It's a good everyday kind of color to go with. It's, um, I don't know, I like the pale pinks mainly because, I don't know, I just think they look good for like an everyday kind of look. If you don't want to do a dramatic lip, it's a little bit more subtle. Okay, this one is kind of sitting a little sticky, maybe because that's because it's drying into like it's matte. But I don't like sticky lips, that's one thing. And then you're like talking and you're like, oh my god, my lips are so sticky. Okay, but it is matte, like 100%. Like it's, it's not shiny at all. I just don't like the stickiness. It's very sticky, so. Okay, I like the color. I like the fact that it, it, it is matte. I don't like the fact that it's sticky. So I'm probably gonna give this one five and a half, six out of 10. It's a shame. I really thought I'd like this one. Look how sticky that was. That should not happen. Maybe I'll have to put like another different kind of gloss on it or some kind of chapstick on it to like not make it so sticky. <laughs> okay, so the next lipstick we're gonna try is the Revlon Color Stay. I used to buy Revlon lipstick a ton, so I figured I'd try their new one, which is the Revlon Color Stay. Okay, so I kind of went out of my comfort zone. I bought this like coral color. Um, and I've never really worn coral before, but I thought this would be cute for the summertime. It is in the shade 075. It's Cruise Collection, so it's perfect for the summer cruise. Okay, this is weird. This is, okay, this looks like a lipstick and it's coming on like a lip gloss. It's not even that pigmented. Yeah, it's legit coming on like a lip gloss. I think I'm more disappointed because it's not that pigmented. It's not that coral. I thought it was gonna be like a pop of coral. Like, look at that too. It's so. 
no, no match. Okay, but it's still nice. I do like the color. The color is a little subtle, so it's not matte. Um, it doesn't even fit. I think, okay, there is color in it. It's just not as much color as I would hope for. I do like it. It's very smooth on the lips and it's not sticky. So I'm going to give this one a seven out of 10. Would I recommend it? Yes, I would recommend it. Just don't expect too much of the pigment. But it is like a very comfortable lipstick to wear. It literally comes off so much more pigmented than it was on my lips. Okay. So the next one I'm going to try on is the L'Oreal. Now this one is the L'Oreal Inflatable Paints Lips. So, okay, so this one is a little bit of a glossy texture as well. Um, it's in the shade Wild Rose 316. And I just, I love bright pink uh, lipstick, so we'll see how this one works. Guys, this smells so good. I smell the candy. How cute. Oh my god, I feel like I'm wearing like a Barbie pink lipstick right now. It smells, oh my god, guys. I think this one's my favorite. I think it's my favorite. Oh my god, how cute. Okay, not sticky, glossy. God, it's so cute. I actually love this one so, so much. Okay, highly recommend this one. This one's definitely a nine out of 10. So, would I recommend it? Yes, nine out of 10. Not glossy, it's glossy, not sticky. Oh my god, but it makes your lips so vibrant and, and it pops so much. God, I'm like obsessed. I can't stop looking at this lipstick. I think it's so cute. Go buy the L'Oreal Inflatable Lipstick, guys. Okay, so the last one I'm gonna try is the Revlon Matte Balm. I didn't realize, but I actually bought two Revlons, but there are different kinds of lipsticks, so I didn't realize I thought I bought five different brands, but I guess not. Okay, so this next one is the color. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It's almost like, it looks like a crayon. Like, I feel like I'm gonna like, have to like color in and paint on my lips. So this shade is in Passionate. It's Passionate. I thought it would be like Passionate Berry or something. It's kind of like a berry color. Um, the number is 260. This one's a matte, so hopefully it's not sticky like the other matte we tried on. Guys, love it. Okay, it doesn't smell like anything, but it has a minty taste to it. I'm not mad about it. I love mint. Okay, but review on the lipstick. Color, amazing. Not sticky. And it's so bright and vibrant. It's so like, hey. Thumbs up for this one. I actually do really like this one. This one, I think I'm gonna rate this one eight and a half out of 10. So all in all, my favorite of all these lipsticks that I made today was the L'Oreal one. Why? Mainly because I like the color the best and it had the best feel. It was such a clean finish. I would have to say my second favorite was the Katy Perry one. I don't know, I just fell in love with it. It's just, it was such just a clean look. Third place was the Revlon Matte Bomb, cause like, and fourth place was the Revlon Color Stay. And the reason why it's fourth place is because it's not as pigmented as, you know, they say be. It was kind of like a, a, like a clear glossy finish, which I didn't really like. I was expecting like a boom, like a coral, and I didn't get that. And lastly was the Maybelline New York, only because I mean, I don't want to walk around with sticky lips all day. I love the color. I think the color is amazing, but I probably won't go out and buy other colors in this in this um, brand because it just was sticky and nobody wants sticky lips throughout the day. Okay, guys, so that's it for my video today. I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, if you want me to review any other products, let me know in the descriptions below. Um, I do like, re I really do like going out and shopping for new beauty products and trying out new things um, in the drugstore because I think it's fun and I like to share with you guys so um head over to the blog and i will actually write out a review there as well um, and come follow me on social media and say hey until uh, then we'll see you guys next time catch you on the flip side